Oh, we got a big sploofer. Oh, let me get out of here. Uh, cancel. Let me out. Let's look at our big sploofers. There they are. These are the first ones I've seen. If I pet them, do they go into the thing? They, they just go into the thing without fighting me at all. We need more of those guys. Wait, the other one didn't go. Hey, you want to go in there? Yeah, he went too now. Yeah, I'm, I'm a big fan of the sploofers so far. Hey, how's it going, everybody? It's your pal Impossible here. And uh, we're back in industrial petting. You guys seem to really love this series. I like playing it. It works out for me. So uh, we have things planned today. That's right. We have plans. Uh, first and foremost, I want to get an automatic carrot planter system going. Uh, somebody told me that uh, I can just throw it in a cannon. And the cannon will shoot out seeds. It'll plant. And then my little robot system will be totally self-sufficient. Uh, I am all about that. Let's make that happen. All right, so we have to build a cannon here. Oh, apparently, we already had one here, which is good to know. I think I'll just throw it, like, there-ish. And uh, we're, we're going to end up fencing this off. But for right now, I think seeds come into this one. So we're going to throw that right there. We're going to throw some seeds in here. Let's add seeds. Yeah, take all my seeds. Take all the seeds. Is it is it doing stuff? It seems to be doing stuff. They're definitely planting themselves here. I'm very happy with that. I think I think we're gonna work out pretty good with this. I'm gonna throw up like a big fence around it. I'm, I'm kind of just waiting until it goes through a lot of the seed to kind of get an idea for where the area is. But I'm, I already have a good idea where the fence is gonna go. So let's just uh, encapsulate this stuff over here. I don't know if we can get all the way behind in here, can we? I don't know, we'll, we'll find out. Let's see where we can put this fence here. Apparently today we're also building a fence. So we're like, we're farming or something. That's what we're doing. Okay, let's build it around this way. I, I guess we'll just have fences all over the place. It's the, uh, it's the petting farm with borders. We believe in borders very much. Uh, just to keep the, uh, <laughs> the unwanted pets out. This is turning into uh, something I didn't mean it to turn into. Uh, you know. We got we got to keep the uh, the animals from eating our, our carrots, all right? If they're eating our carrots, they have to officially be one of our animals. Otherwise, you know, they're just uh, they're wasting our product here. All right, so let's. I think I built this a little bit too big, if I'm being honest. But you know, whatever. We'll uh, we'll see what happens here. Actually, I think I can just join this into this fence over here, and I'll be happy enough with that. Can I connect it? Can I connect? Is that? I guess I think that's officially connected. I hope so. Let's see if we can go connect the other one. Where do I even have it going? Uh, yeah, this is definitely bigger than I need it to be. Uh, I'm not horribly against it. I mean, it's kind of okay. I'll try to make sure that I don't get this, uh, <laughs> this whatchamacallit guy in here. The, uh, toadstool guy. Oh, I have to put one more. Come on. There we go. Well, can I get this guy to go into his light yet? Come on, guy. Follow me! Follow me! I am the most important thing in your life! Follow me into the light! Like, this guy has just been, like, hanging out in my base, hanging out with the, all the, uh, nibblers this whole time. Going crazy. There we go. It took, like... I don't know how many times I tried to get that guy over here, but let me assure you, it was a lot. But anyway, let's get our, uh, production of stuff over here going. I kind of repositioned some of the pet guys. I put them, like, right near the light things. So hopefully they'll get happy and go, like, right into the light. That's my hope. I'm not entirely sure if that's true or not. Hey, you want to go into the light, buddy? You want to go over here instead of, like, eating all my food while you're already happy? I mean, come on. What do you think you are, buddy? Yeah. Right, do, we have, do we have any more food? Let's put down a couple more things in here. I don't have a cannon to feed this one yet. Uh, I don't think I tend to make enough of these to really warrant one, so I'm not all that worried about it. Let's put some food over here near the, uh, near the light of doom <laughs> or salvation, as, as we would tell them. Uh, but it, it's obviously a doom. Alright, come on. One more. Can we fit it somewhere? Anywhere? Can I shove you somewhere? There, there we go. And, uh, I think this... We just need more carrots in here, I think. Let's add some more carrots. I don't know how many you have. Enough, apparently. There we go. We'll get some of those, uh, big hefty boys in there. How many, how many nibbler things do I have? Do I have enough to add more? Apparently I had 12. That's enough. It takes... I think the uh, the main holdback on them is carrots anyway. They, they eat carrots for days. But they're getting them, so hopefully we'll get more of them. 
Let's check and see how our uh, carrot farming is going. I think, honestly, I mean, this is obviously unethical and horrible, but this is so much easier than, like, going into the forest and mining mushroom trees, in my opinion. Like, the nearest mushroom field that I know of... Hold on, where is it? I built an arrow to show show me, like, what direction it was. See, every time I, I tried to find it, I, I well, I couldn't. Uh, it took me, like, forever. I don't remember where it is. Anyway, uh... I put it on, like, the edge of the forest so I could find it, but of course now I can't find it. But it's like a million miles in one direction, and that's like the only one i found so far. So it's like, I don't want to try to build, like, some kind of tube system coming all the way back here. That would just be absolutely ridiculous. Oh, I built it right here. This is where I built it. I built it next to my base. So we'd have to go that way for, like, 15 minutes to get to the stupid mushroom area that I found. And no, thank you. I'd rather not try to set up a tube system that far away. Okay, are you guys happy over here? I'm like, we got a couple of them coming out. But they seem to be just eating my food. Oh, no, no, it's working. It's working. They're eating and going in there. All right, I'm happy with that. Let's go and see how our, uh, our uh, contract situation is like. I haven't done a contract in a while. Uh, we can get a slime hat. I mean, we can kind of just, like, do that. Okay, we'll, we'll get a slime hat. We can get a goo hat. I don't have near enough goo things. There's tons of those goo guys in my uh, in my base over here. I mean, you can see them all, like right in here, just hanging out. But are they coming over and going into the light? And the answer is no. Although I do need to put more of them in here. Do I have any uh, goo guys in here? Nope. All right, let me go get some slime cuddlers. We'll pump out more of those bad guys. They're a little bit slow to get going, but uh. I will do what I can. Let's take out... I'll take out like that many of them. I think I only put like 80 in the box anyway, but we'll take out that many. We'll see how it goes. They sit in my base just like honking and like running around being stupid like forever anyway. Like, look at these guys. They're like praising this factory or something. They think it's like, you know, their Allah or something. I don't, I don't really understand it, but look at them. They're just all looking at it and bouncing up and down making honky noises. That's all they do. And look, I got food all over the place here. I got this petting thing here. I got another petter thing over there. Do they go eat food and get petted and go into the light? No, they do not. They do anything they can to avoid going into the light. I don't understand it. I don't understand it at all. All right, what are we doing over here? Do, are you guys doing my carrot stuff? You should be doing my carrot stuff. Why aren't you planting more carrots, sir? There should be more carrots here. Do I, do I have to make the area bigger or should I make... Should I make another thrower? Maybe. Maybe I can make another thrower and just like put it over here or something? Or set it back further and just have it like throw in? I don't know. But my uh, my carrot farming guy doesn't even seem to be keeping up with stuff. Hey, what are you doing, sir? You're my carrot farmer guy, aren't you? Where's my other, my other guy? I got two of them over here. Did I lock them out? That would be funny. No, no, there's one of them. I don't know what this guy's deal is. Did he move? I guess where he's just here. Am I, am I going crazy? Yeah, he moved. All right. Uh, well, I'll pick up this carrot myself then, since you're not going to pick it up. Yeah, one of them is definitely my carrot guy. I don't, I don't know what his deal is. is. Is the carrot thing full? Are you full? Let me, let me look at it. There's no nothing in there. There's no carrots in there. The guy's not doing anything. Are, are we're set to carrots, aren't we? Like, I could have swore. Uh, where's, where's the... Uh, can I... Do I have to go into here? I don't remember where exactly I have to go here. Uh, reverse direction. Drive. I don't want to drive while I can beep. He's not even beeping. I'm hitting the beep button and there's no beeping happening. Very disappointed. Alright, can I... I don't want to drive. I just want to, like, exit... I just want to choose what you're going into here. I want to disconnect you for the time being so I can go into your options here. Yeah, g gather carrots. That's definitely what you're supposed to be doing. But I don't feel like you're doing it. Look at all the carrots we got over here. You're not going after any of them. Am I imagining this? I mean, come on, dude. Maybe I should move it. Maybe he just doesn't like where he is. Can I move this thing? I'll disconnect it and I'll move it. We'll get him in a happier carrot place, maybe. Like, maybe he doesn't know about carrots from there. I don't know. He's, he's obviously confused about things. That's all I'm saying. We turn this thing around, yeah. You'll, you'll want to go that way. All right, and we'll connect you over here. I'll get the carrot things going again. 
Oh, let me click on it. You are gathering carrots, sir. Gather your carrots well. You gonna gather for me now? Like, he, I don't know what his deal was, but he was definitely not gathering carrots for me. And I will definitely pick up all these seeds before you guys let them go to waste. The, uh, go to way, uh, why can't I speak? Go to waste. I feel like they're not actually picking up all my stuff. I don't know, I mean... Maybe it's my imagination. I feel like a lot of this stuff here is just not getting picked up. But they're definitely doing it now. They're working on stuff. This guy, you gonna pick up my seeds? You, you picking them up, buddy? You gonna get them? Yeah, he just sucks them up. Apparently, he, like, sucks them right into, like, his mouth little area. That's kind of cool. I haven't actually watched him do that before. All right. Let me go pick up my, uh... My little, uh, <laughs> spore farm area here. There we go. It's like, you know, I just come through here every, like, five minutes or so. And I get all, t all sorts of spores, man. I mean, it's so much easier than setting all things up. You know, it's horrible and I feel bad about it, but, yeah, I'm okay with it. All right, let's see if we can do another contract. I, I, I know I looked to see if we could do the, uh... The slime one, but we couldn't. The, the goo colors just take too long for me to make for some reason. Um, I can do the... Sp I don't really care about spore hats, if I'm being totally honest. Well, I'll do the spore hat, because I can, I guess. It'll give me something else. I can get I can get a shroom hat. Um, maybe eventually. I don't have the big shroom thing going on. We don't have very many of the shrooms at all. I mean, I am building them in here. I'll go check and see if my uh, my thing is full. I ran out of spores. I tried to do what I can to make us have as many spores as we can over here, but it's like... Being that I don't have, like, a, a constant, you know, gathering bot feeding this, I kind of just have to fill up these boxes. And then I, like, you know, after, like, five minutes or so, I forget, and then they go un unproductive for, like, another hour or so. It's kind of ridiculous. All right, let's go see. Uh, I think we we have to do shroom stuff. We have to make the big shroom guys. Maybe I have to make efforts to make even more shroom guys. Maybe I should set up, like, another one of these. It'd be nice if I could just copy this and, like, paste it down again. I'd like to have, like, basically the same setup. Because all I need is lots of shrooms, and I can do that. That's not so hard. Anyway, let's see what we need to make one of the boom uh, big shroom guys. I think you just need little shrooms and maybe more powder or something? I, I don't know. Let's, let's put down a pet assembler and we'll figure it out. What do we need for carrot pie? We just need green goo and sliced carrots. We might need some green goo. Let me make some sliced carrots. What do I, oh, I need more green goo. I, I need something like... I need a receptacle just to give myself gr more green goo. Because sometimes I just need it and I don't have any nearby. Look, it looks like our green, our goo production might be a little low. It could be my imagination. I don't know. It just it just feels low. I and mean, we were backed up over here, but this side, this side is needing it. Anyway, I have a I have a quick plan for uh, harvesting goo. It's the most most ingenious plan. It is uh, the most thoughtless. I'll just do this really quick plan. But that's okay. That's what most of my plans are. Let's throw this down really quick. We'll just have one of these things feeding into this. And I'll just pick up the green goo that comes out of it every once in a while. That way I at least have some kind of green goo supply without having to, uh... Well, without having to hit, sit here and just, like, steal them all as they come in. Although I do feel like we're low on green goo. That guy is still being gooed. That guy's still being grooed. Uh, maybe we should start gooing these guys right in the middle of our thing here. I mean, I'm making it sound weird, but I think they need to be gooed. Or de-gooed. Can I move these guys out the way? I'm gonna, like, de this area hardcore. But you, you guys need to go. I need to get some... I need to get my goo on. Come on, guys. Get out the way here. Follow me into the light. No? They're not following me at all. I don't think they care that I exist at all. Can I put... Can I... Hold on. Where, I didn't even mean to hit that. Where's the goo extractor? I was just looking at the harvester. Can, can I go down really quick? It's like the second it goes white for me to put it down, one of the, one of the little goobers just like goes right in the way. Move, goober! Move! There, we're gonna put it right there. We're gonna find a way to get this over this way. Or, I don't know where I'm even gonna get this. It's it's gonna be rough. Let's just get another goober over here first. We'll, uh, we'll tackle the easier things first. 
We'll build another one. This one, hopefully, we can just jab into this line over here without too much effort. God forbid things take effort. I'm totally against it. Here, let's get that guy over there. Let's go into our... I don't know why I went into that. Let's go into our... What am I even looking for? I'm not looking for anything in there. I think I just want to do this. Yeah, that, that's all I was looking for. I don't know why my brain wasn't working, but it most definitely wasn't. All right, we'll just connect there. Good, that's uh, just going into our incoming goo supply that's coming from, like, way over there somewhere. And uh, we got one bit of goo coming in from there. I'd like to get this goo to come over here, too. I could just feed that into the same line. It'd be nice. But I think I'm going to have to build a tower to go across this. I could be wrong, but I don't think I am. Let me see if I can get a tower down here. I'm going to need two of them. There we go. Let's get these towers down. Okay. I'm going to need it to go something like... Something like this. Why, why can I not put the tower down? I definitely need to put a tower down right around here. Does that... Does I have to go like... There's white for a second. You know, you know, let me put a tower down. Please? I need... I need to put a tower down. There we go. Right there. There we go. We gotta put another one down. Oh, God. Can I do it here? Would this work? I can try it. Like, I don't know if that'll even reach. Can I reach you from here? Can you go there? It can go there. Good. Now, as long as this can go to there, we're good. This is, uh, this is some of the ugliest, uh, <laughs> connections in the world here, but we're, we're making it work, all right? We're going to get rid of those green goos who are right in the middle of our base. We'll have more room for stuff, and we need more green goo anyway, and I want to fill my little green goo box over here anyway. There we go. We got 33 already. All right. I wanted to make some carrot cake. I don't know why. It's just like, I don't... Hold on. I just... I, I don't have carrot cake. I want to make them. We're going to let that keep going for a while. Wow. Oh, yeah. What I was going to do is I was going to put down another uh, a pet thingy to see what we need for the big spoofer. I'm so absent-minded sometimes. Uh, let's see. Pet assembler guy. We're going to have you face this way because reasons. Can I shove you down there? Oh, there's a, there's a thing in the way. Let me move this forward a little bit. We'll just move that right over there somewhere. You guys go that way. That is where you officially belong. All right, let's get our pet assembler down. Facing relatively the same way. There we go. And we're going to put this on the big sploofers and see what they need. The sizable sploofer. They're not even big ones. They're just sizable. Oh, so they just need green goo. Okay, and regular spoofers, of course. Uh, okay, well, I can accomplish that, but I'm going to need to do more weird things, which I'm not a big fan of. I mean, we can make it happen. But man, I'm like overusing these trunks. Like, I, like I got trunks all over my base for like everything now, and I don't even, like, I can't even have them labeled, so I don't even know what they all are for at, at this point anymore. I just have to like look at them and say, okay, what's near this thing? All right, let's get that. Let's get these things spoofering again. Having to manually do this is uh, really frustrating, quite honestly. Uh, games like this, it's all about the joy of like automating everything. And uh, as far as I can tell, you really can't automate this very well. Uh, the spores, as far as I can understand, you can mine from trees, but they're a limited resource. Uh, you know, not from these trees, from the mushroom trees, which, like I said, are like literally a 15-minute walk that way, which is kind of ridiculous. Uh, do, do, do. We also need sploofers. Okay, let me get... I got the green goo, which I'm capturing over here. They could do something with, but I honestly, I could just take it out of the line over here and I'd be fine. Let's just do that. Uh, so what I all I need here is a trunk just for me to put sploofers in, I guess. There we go. Let's put a sploofer down here. Uh, there we go. I don't even know how many I have in my, in my base, to be honest. I'm not really producing all that many of them. How many spoofers? I'm going to take pets, sploofer. I'm going to take all of you, I guess, for now. I want to get the big sploofers. All right, we're going to throw sploofers in here. Add sploofer, all of them. And we're going to take from... I'll just take right out of this line, honestly. Although, to be honest, this line is not giving us all that much slime. I feel like this line could be producing a lot more slime 
it currently is. I guess whatever we're doing here is taking a lot of it. It's just making regular uh, colors with that slime. Okay. Fair enough. We got extra stuff feeding into the other line of slime coming through over here. I think it'd be better for me to tap into that, even though it's going to be more of a pain in, pain in the butt to get uh, access to. Um, hold on, let me, let me move this. If I can move you to there, then I can pull off of this and it's less annoying. Only by a little bit. A little bit works for me. This, this feels so silly that I'm going right back, right alongside another one of my lines. But uh, that line over there essentially <laughs> doesn't do much. It does not supply much, quite honestly. Because it's basically capped out supplying the other thing. In fact, I can kind of get rid of it and I wouldn't lose much of anything at all. Alright, let's uh, come over here. I might just do that if I'm being honest. Come over here, move a little bit more. Oh wait, what am I looking for? Oh yeah, I want to go up in here. Okay, we're, we're going to go up in here. You're going to connect over here. Like, I've lost total track of what I was doing here. Now you are going to make sizable sploofers. You're going to do that for me? We're getting the green goo in. We have the sploofers. We have liftoff. We're doing sploofy things, which I'm kind of happy about. We're getting a fair bit of goo coming this way. What is my goo situation over here? I'm always looking for more goo. You guys know that about me. There we go. We're always needing more goo for stuff. And while we're waiting for a sizable sploofer to come out, I'm going to try putting down some of these pies. Maybe I get some of these guys to uh, go into the light if they see some of these pies. You guys like the pies? You want to go into the light for me? I'm putting them down. I'm hoping they're all about the pies. You guys like pies over here? I'll put some pies by this light too. Can I just shove it down there? You want to, you want to go down there? There we go. We'll see if they eat the pies. I'm keeping an eye out real quick. I just want to see. Goo cuddler, are you going to eat the pie? Are you going to go into the light? Somebody ate it. He ate it, and he didn't go into the light. What if I pet you? Will you go into the light now? Are you going to go? No. They, like, all the pies are gone, but none of them have gone into the light. And if I, if I pet all of them? Oh, I, why is the pet machine not petting them? They, they seem to be happy, but they're not going into the light. Maybe maybe it's not in a good place. Maybe they don't like where it's placed. Hold on, let me... Maybe they couldn't, like, get to it from where they were? Hold on. Will you, will you guys get out the way, please? Jeebus, you guys make putting down petting machines for you so hard. Get out the way, guy. Yo. All of you, get out the way. All right, let's see if we can put this petting machine down before I forget what I was doing again. Can we make it fit, like, right... Where's the best place I can make this thing fit? I'm trying to give myself like the most room possible. I tried just like shoving it on the thing, but maybe they can't get to it if I do that. I don't know. I, they should have room to get to it now. So hopefully if they want pettings, they can get right in front of it and just go get pettings. And that, does this like automatically pet stuff? I can poke it. Can I drive it? I can drive it. What does driving it do? Can I like pick who to pet? Um, I'm hitting E, but it's not doing anything, and I can't turn. Oh, I can turn! Oh, I can, I can move around super slow! Okay. And if I hit E, does it do anything? I'm spamming the E button, but not much is happening. I don't think... I'm not entirely sure that these things are fully operational. If I'm being honest. Can they move through the pipes and stuff? I feel like the, the pipes and stuff are definitely going to hinder their movement. Can you move it? Mm, yeah, he can't move through the pipe. Alright, I, I just figured, but you know, I figured I'd like, you know, just verify. Oh, we got a big sploofer! Oh, let me get out of here. Uh, cancel. Let me out. Let's look at our big sploofers. There they are! These are the first ones I've seen. If I pet them, do they go into the thing? They, they just go into the thing without fighting me at all! We need more of those guys! Wait, the other one didn't go. Hey, you want to go in there? Yeah, he went too now. Yeah, I'm, I'm a big fan of the sploofers so far. You pet them, they go. You don't have to mess with them. That is so nice. Anyway, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this one. We got some stuff done. We have uh, our carrot farm over here. It was automatically carroting, I hope. You doing carrot stuff? Our, uh, our carrot robot is still confused about how to get our carrots, apparently. Uh, but our seed robot seems to be doing okay. We have all sorts of seeds in here ready to be thrown out. 
as soon as our guy picks up the carrots. Maybe maybe I'll have to pick up the carrots. He's not doing a very good job. I might throw down like another carrot bot. I don't know. And, and uh, so we got that going. We, we did a contract. We uh, re we moved some things around. We uh, got the giant spoofers, which is a big thing for me. We did stuff, okay? We did stuff. It's official. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you're interested in the game, it is called Industrial Petting. I'll have a link down in the description. Uh, if you guys are new to this channel, you can go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Click that bell icon so you know when I put it new content. Smash that like button. Leave a comment down below. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.